My name is Anthony Romani. I'm a forward for the Toronto Junior Canadians, and my hometown is Pickering, Ontario. From the York Simcoe Express, Quinton Byfield. Shane Wright from the Don Mills Flyers. North Bay Battalion select Ty Nelson of the Toronto Junior Canadians. Anthony Romani of the uh, Toronto Junior Canadians um, was definitely a, uh, a spark plug for his team. You know, he wasn't afraid to go to the dirty areas. He would. He would go to the net. He would he would drive on the four check. Um, you know, he's one of those players that has that, that that ability to to find that open ice in the slot, whether it's a high slot or moving down or jumping in, jumping out. He's got that ability um, to do those kind of things. You know, and he can he's a, he's a competitor. He'll you know take a hit to make a play along the wall to get the puck out. You know, he'll he'll. Um, you know, he, he, he drives the net not even worrying about anything or the contact that he's going to get. Um, see, a lot of times nowadays, kids won't drive the net as hard, but he's definitely one that you can see loves to score goals. Um, you know, in 20 in 32 games last year, he had 28 goals. Um, you know, probably probably his biggest attribute is is his shot in the slot. You know, when when he gets that puck from one of his teammates, it's on his stick, off his stick. You know, and he doesn't give the goaltenders a lot of time to set up and, and adjust to what he's doing. He gets it on the net as quick as he can, but and it's not just getting it on net. He's got something on it that's very accurate. Too. I think I'm a hardworking player who will do whatever it takes to win. I feel I'm well-rounded and can be put into any situation. To describe my game, I'd say I'm a skilled forward who uses my hockey IQ to create plays around the ice. I like to get creative in the offensive zone as well as score goals and set up my teammates. I'm still able to play a 200-foot game and be responsible in my defensive zone. I'd say my best hockey skills would be my hockey IQ and my shot. I feel my hockey IQ really allows me to make plays around the ice and read read plays before they even happen so I have an advantage over my opponent. I think my shot has been a skill that I've really worked on and I think it's really important at the next level as the goalies are much bigger and better. So just having a good shot accuracy and quick release will really help me score. I like to model my game after Mitch Marner I really love how he sees the game and can see plays before they even happen. He uses his hockey IQ and likes to get creative to create scoring chances and opportunities around the ice, and he makes the players around him better. And Anthony will transition to the league well, you know, because he, he brings those intangibles that um, the coaches love, you know, the, the compete, the doing all the little things, being on the right side of the puck, you know, I'm not afraid to hang on to the puck and take that hit just to get it out. Um, you know, like I said earlier, when uh, when he gets a chance in the offensive zone, he's he's pretty uh, he's pretty good at capitalizing on his chances. Um, so you know, those two things alone, you know, kids that compete in our level at our league um, always tend to be successful. So I'm not uh, I, I have a feeling that Anthony will be successful moving forward at our league level, um, just by competing and the ability when he's got the ability to score like he does. Something I've been trying to work on is just getting bigger and stronger. I know in the OHL, the players are much stronger and it's a faster paced game. So just working on my strength and getting my overall strength and speed up would really help me compete if I get a chance to play with them. Um, over the past year, I've been fortunate enough to get on the ice quite often and I've used every minute to my advantage to just work on my skills. Um, I've also been working out, working on my strength and conditioning with my trainer and just doing any little thing I can do at home, like shooting pucks or going out for runs, just so I'm in top shape and my best form when the season comes. Uh, Anthony's, uh, something I saw of Anthony this year that, you know, I've kind of mentioned before, but, you know, his his shot's kind of his bread and butter. You know, he gets that puck in the slot and he's, he's not going to, he's not going to miss, you know. So watching him play some four on four this year um, in these inner squad games and these, you know, these events that we watched this year, when he got the puck in the slot, you know, not many times he missed, you know, that's, that's pretty impressive for a kid that, uh, at that age is, uh, it's one thing that, to have that at that age already moving forward. Um, it would mean a lot. It's always been a dream of mine to play in the OHL and just hearing my name on draft day would be amazing. <laughs>